good day this is your Barbados apple project guy successfully growing and uh, fruited apples well in the sunny tropical Barbados okay and today I want to talk to you about growing apples using cuttings I know it is very difficult okay but as a person who's growing um, apples and um, apple trees and seeds okay it will obviously take a very very long time if I put one around I have a tree I have a tree there that um, gave me lots of the flowers a little under three years, okay. But if you if you are growing apples by, by seed, um, it's going to take a very long time. Some people say as much as five to eight years before you can actually get uh, blossoms, okay. But one of the ways around it is to do some cloning. So as my trees grow, I have been cloning. I've been using um, grafting. I've been using ear layering, and I's, I'm also using um, cuttings, okay. I just want to show you some of the things that I've been doing with the cuttings. If you can just take a look down here. Um, these here are cuttings that I've taken from my apple tree and as you can see they've been here for quite a while and as you can see um, you're getting some 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 growth here I'm gonna let these stay in here for a couple um, months and I want to see if I can get some roots this one here um, also is a cutting actually this is, not, this is part of one I earlier that was unsuccessful so they, they took off the, the bottom and I have put it in a pot and it has given me some, some new growth, okay? Today I'm going to show you what I do to, um, to make cuttings to get them to, to, to this stage, okay? And then I'll update you as, as time goes on. I'll let you know if these root and if the ones that I'll put in here work out if they will root. So my cuttings here, let me get them, okay? Um, what I have this, um, this roughed up the, the bottom part a bit. The next thing that I'm going to do, I have a bit of um, rooting hormone, okay, um, I think it's almost empty though, so I can, right, so what I will do is I will just dip my finger in here, and put it along here, okay, so I just roughed up the bottom a bit, so this one here, I guess I'll put the rooting hormone Along here, okay, and do the same thing for this one, okay, and this encourages root development, I guess, I believe. It's not absolutely necessary, but okay, so I'm just gonna um, put some more around up here, okay, and I normally leave these in my garage, I just brought them up so you can see them. Um, that is where they've been growing and growing pretty well. So I decided you'll stay there for a couple of months and I will update you on F when there is root development and as the leaves um, develop the bud and so on, I will obviously um, update you. So let's put a little bit of hormone compound and then the next thing that I'll do and then no special treatment, I'll just um, put it the soil and this is just some dirt. I got from around here, but it's not um, clay, it's not cloggy, it's a mixture of some sand and some loamy soil. Okay, so I'm gonna put that one in there as well, and I'm also gonna put this one in here. Okay, and I will update you. I'm gonna just make sure that they press them together, and I'm gonna give them a little water, and then let me water them a bit here. Let me get water. Okay, and I will update you. And then I guess you will see if these give me some new leaves, some new buds, and hopefully over time, okay, they will give me some roots, and I will have some more apple trees to add to my apple orchard. Okay, so that has been my update. I'm just showing you a bit of my cuttings and what I'm doing um, to my apple project. Okay, so. Until next time, remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel, Bajan Apple Project. Until next time.